The Little Reindeer by Nicola Killen It was Christmas Eve and Ollie had just gone to sleep when jingle, 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 she awoke again with a start. What's that sound? She rushed to the window, but all she could see was a blanket of fresh snow. Grabbing her sled, she ran downstairs and stepped out into the wintry night. Ollie jumped up to catch a falling snowflake when she heard the magical sound again. Jingle, jingle, jingle. She had to follow it. Whoosh! Racing down the hill, she heard the ringing again. Jingle, jingle, jingle. And this time, it was much clearer. The bells got louder as the wind whistled and the trees shook. Jingle, jingle, jingle. Ollie was getting close. She took a deep breath and feeling very brave, she ran into the darkness. There hanging from a branch was a collar circle with silver bells. Who could it belong to? Then came a new sound. Crunch, crunch, crunch. A reindeer stepped through the crisp snow towards Ollie. Hello, she whispered, not quite believing her eyes. Are you looking for this? The reindeer knelt down patiently while Ollie fastened his collar. He lowered himself even farther. Ollie knew exactly what to do and climbed onto his back. She wondered if they could go for a ride through the forest. But to her surprise, they soared up into the night sky, leaving the trees far below. The new friends landed softly in the snow. Thank you, Ollie whispered. They didn't want to part, but there was someone very special who needed the reindeer's help that night. Yawning sleepily, Ollie crept back to her room. And soon, dreaming of her magical journey, jingle, jingle, jingle. This time, the silver bells didn't wake Ollie. And her reindeer flew through the night sky once more. In the morning, Ollie found her presents. Now she would always think of her new friend. See you next year, she whispered. The End